Hey, good morning, guys. Yes, yeah, so we're in the baby goat pen this morning. We are getting snuggles. We are getting uh, chewed on this morning. This is uh, Yo Play, who is just really turning out to be the star of this morning's show. Okay, Emery, you said that Yo Play is one of the most friendly ones of the bunch, yes. right? Yeah. Okay, so we've got this pen full of baby goats. About uh, how many would you say are in here? Uh, two. Nine. nine? Oh, she says exactly. <laughs> Ashton's over here saying nine. Um, so the mamas are next door. We kind of hung out with them last time. And we're going to let them in now, in now. You guys keep them pretty close because they're still at a really young age, right? Yep. Okay, so let's let them in. What, are we, what, are you, what happens when they're reunited? Because that's usually how it is in the baby goat experience, right, Emery? Yes. So we'll expect them. Um, so they're being weaned right now. Uh, so they stay out of the pen for a little while. So we're expecting most of the babies to go right for uh, their mom. The moms. The moms are starting to wean them, so we'll see if the moms actually let them nurse any. And um, that's kind of individual based on how old they are. So Yo Play is the oldest. Um, she's probably not going to get to drink any because her mom's mostly weaned her already. Whereas um, ones like Partridge um, and Over Moonbeam here. are probably going to be more likely to nurse. Gotcha. And then a lot of people love to hear the names. Um, and and what, talk to me about your naming system since we have the moms and the babies in one pen. Right. So we name them all um, from their mother. So their mother's letter, uh, the first letter of their name gets passed on to all of their kids. So um, Nessa, for instance, had Nebula and Nina. And um, <laughs> Yo Play, or Yogurt had Yo Play. And Integrity had incense. Gotcha. So they kind of get their, their letters from their mothers, and then it carries on. So we have our different lines. You've got, your, you've got about, you go, yep, yep. Nobody's off limits, right? Oh, so we, oh, and we have another guest here. This is Benjamin, the barn cat. I mean, there's just no telling the animals that you're scaring me that you're going to see when you come out here to goat milk stuff, right? That is correct. Oh, my goodness. Well, talk to me a little bit about um, what else, the other things you do on the farm besides the, goat, the baby goat experience. Right. So we have um, a bunch of different animals on the farm, um, and then... Uh, during COVID, before COVID, we did a lot of tours and stuff, and we're starting to be able to reopen that. Um, and then we also have the farm store where you can um, purchase all of the... Goat milk soap and products and stuff like that. Yep. Nice. Well, we are just getting it all. <laughs> we are just taking it all in this morning, and I'm just keeping my eye on Benjamin the barn cat up here because he's worrying me just a little bit. He's still a little kitten, but you guys, this has been a blast. you got to come out here and do it with your kids. I think Benjamin okay? might smell it's your funny. cat queenie. <laughs> and say, oh, she's a cat attention. lady. I was going to say, I'm shocked lady. she hasn't Call been <laughs> petting Benjamin all morning <laughs> since you, you love the cats, out. I have. I just put Benjamin down. Oh, so. okay. Benjamin wants to come back down, just all the way down. down. Yes. Yeah.